one. Okay, you gotta, you gotta move. Hi. Ha! 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 Oh, that was dirty. Okay. Do your parrot voice that you did. Hello! Hello, dirty. All right, mates, welcome back to the super sensitive show. I'm here with my boyfriend, Matthew. Hello, it's, it's good to be here. That's good. I dragged I've him. I've been a big fan for a while now. Oh yeah, how many episodes have you watched? So many. I'm sorry. All, all of them. I'm flaming you already. All of them, <laughs> I've seen all of them. So it's good to finally be on the infamous couch. We Not are that coach. so excited and nervous, but mainly excited. We are going to um, talk a little bit about us selfishly and how we make That's what our... we do best. Though. That's what we do I best, think. I think. Really good at it. <laughs> we are going to talk about long distance and you know how that impacts a relationship for better and also. For worse. For better. For better. Mostly for better. And we're also going to play this really cool game called We're Not Really Strangers. Um, and I've heard a lot of things about this game. And I've heard a lot of scandalous things about this game, too. That it can be a little bit um, of a tearjerker. Um, so basically, if we get any of those cards, we're just going to skip on us. Crier. We're just going to You're a big crier. Yeah, I'm a big one. <laughs> womp womp. Um, tell me about yourself. That's a big question. Like, okay. Do you want what do you details? Do? Yeah. What do you do for a living? I'm I'm a surveyor, mm -hmm. so I kind of work construction and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I work to make money so I can come see my sortie in <laughs> Tirana. In Tirana. I was fortunate enough to get a call. They said, you want to work in Toronto? What? I was like, why? Why not? I'll try it. So, worked here for the summer, downtown Toronto, and I think I was on what, Hinge? Just looking for That's a, a really cool bar on Queen Street, if you've ever been. We met in a, in a bar, by chance. Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a bar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so we met on Hinge, and uh, Sparks flew. Sparks flew. We went Sparks to actually Italy. fucking exploded. Went, went to Italy, had fun there. He took me on the subway for the first time. It was a fun summer. It was a fun summer. Did lots of fun things. We did, we went to Guelph. Guelph. Guelph is like, the name is spelt like how you would react Guelph. when you get to Guelph. Yeah. Really, the hotels were just cheaper there, so we chose to go there on a trip. I'm from Edmonton, Alberta. And how do you like it there? How do I like it there? Oh, it's great there. I love how it there. How do you like it here? Here? Sorry, it's, Sorry. it's a little big. It's, it's big and uh, it's a little expensive. Mm -hmm. Cramped. Cramped, yeah. Dirty. There's rats here too. See, I haven't seen any rats. You haven't been out at night. Downtown, in the back alleys. It is kind of a dirty city um, in comparison. Yeah, but it's, it's fun. You can do a lot of things here. Yeah. So yeah, we, we kind of take turns visiting each other. I mean, you more than me. How do I like Edmonton? I love Edmonton. I do, I do. Yeah. I love it, and the way I described it to my family when I came home was, um, it's like a really cool big city that doesn't smell like poop everywhere you go. Like, like I would be downtown, and the air it was like clean air. I don't have to go home and rinse my nose out with one of those nettle pot things. Yeah. And then when you go home, it doesn't take you an hour and a half. Although it might take you a bit if you're on the hen day. Still stuck in the hen day. Okay, so we were at West Edmonton Mall and there was like an Edmonton gift shop. You know, the, you know how cities have like gift shops that like promote their city, but like in like a quirky indie way. And there was a t-shirt that was like still stuck on the hen day, which is like the big highway in Edmonton. And it's, it's like- It's Canada's first Free flow ring road. It's, it, what's a ring road? A ring road. So you know what a ring looks like? I fucking wish I did. <laughs> you, you, you <laughs> I like, wish I did. Like, um, it's, yeah, road. 
It just goes in yeah. circles. Yeah. Oh, it's like a Mario Kart. Loop. It's like, yeah, it's like a circuit. If you were in Mario Kart on the Hyundai, what character would you play? What character? Yeah. I mean, I like a Toad. I think Toad's a good balance because he's he's light, he's nimble, so he's a little quick. And, and, and I like the emojis. What would you say about Toadette? You wouldn't pick her, right? Who's she? We're at the TIFF, downtown Toronto. On location. On site, at the TIFF. Um, we were on the subway and there was some woman screaming. Oh, that's what I love about this city. That's what the I love. The difference is like, the people like oh yeah, I love that. He actually loves it. I, I love the people watching because you see all these characters walk by and they're just doing random, who knows what they're doing, what they're on maybe, I don't know. But I think we need more of them because that's the entertainment. Like we're going to a Raptors game. Mm -hmm. We could just stand outside of and the arena be, and I'd be, be doing living. fine. I'd be doing just fine. Well, I hope you know that's what we're doing because we couldn't get Artists. actual tickets. So <laughs> we're actually going to be standing outside. Um, but let's get into this game. There is three levels. The first one is perception, which I'm pretty sure is like, you kind of don't, you, it's like first impressions, I'm pretty sure, on the person. Second level is connection. Okay, we can get those. And then the third one is reflection. Alright. <laughs> Gabe, Gabe, if you could cut that out for me. Level one. Immediately now. Okay. What character would I play in a movie? You are. This is a movie. The character. Cop out answer? I don't know. Um, what's the Disney Cinderella? And I'm. Prince Charming? Is that Prince Charming? No, that's not Prince Charming. Yeah. No. <laughs> Sleeping, Sleeping Beauty. Beauty. That's Prince Charming. I think Sleeping Beauty is Prince Charming. So you think I'm lazy? No, no. I, 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 I think you're, you're beautiful. <laughs> and you sleep. I'll take that. Aurora is very beautiful. What do we mean? Um. <laughs> what comes to mind? What comes to mind? Shrek. <laughs> Actually, donkey. Donkey. <laughs> I'm I'm donkey. I would say donkey. Why donkey? Because he's just got. Because I'm an ass. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, um, gonna... Because you, you're witty. I'm witty. Kind of witty, and sometimes you're a little Delulu. Delulu. But in like a fun little, like, you, fun like everybody way. loves donkey. And also, you're dating someone who's a dragon. fiery. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're quite the dragon. <laughs> fierce. <laughs> you're, you're fierce. Yeah. All right, that's actually not too bad. That's a good play. Yeah. Laura lent me this deck, and I really hope I don't. She's not gonna watch this. Well, <laughs> she does watch it. Um, let's go to level two. I'll just kind of grab that one. Here, you you grab one. Level two. Has a stranger ever changed your life? I mean, <laughs> come on. Yeah. <laughs> I Le was gonna level talk two. about the woman who whose life we saved. Oh, no, there's multiple date. lives that we saved. <laughs> it was also a thing. We had two or three dates where we just saved lives. We just saved lives. What was yeah. the... What was you the... think these people save lives. They don't. They, they don't. don't know what saving lives is. We save lives. What's your mother's name? And the <laughs> most beautiful thing about her? Um, my mother's name Natalia. is Natalia. With, with, a, with a J. With a J in the middle. Silent. Not, not, not at the, the beginning. beginning. <laughs> which, <laughs> um, the most beautiful, beautiful thing? The most beautiful thing about her. The most beautiful thing about her is her energy and how it just never really runs out. Like, I can ask her for anything at any point and she's just like, yes, let's do it. And if it's like a challenging thing, she's like, we're gonna get this done. Yeah. Like, um, 
when I took my first like driver's test that like actually lets you drive alone, um, I was like, oh, the only test is in Kingston. And she's like, fuck yeah, let's go to King you don't know where that is. Kingston. No. Two hours away. It's like a two hour drive to the drive test center. This was in COVID when there were like no drive test times, spots at all. And she was like, yes, we're gonna go there and you're gonna get it. We didn't drive here for nothing. And that, Did I you got get it. it? I got it. Mind you, I was one point off. You wanna know what I got? What? What about me is the hardest for you to understand? Oof. Probably the way you see things like creatively. Mm-hmm. I think that's gotta be it. Yeah. At first, I was like, oh, that's a weird way of seeing something. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh, I love that about you. Mm-hmm. But that's, I don't know, that's, that's why I do love you, because the way you perceive things, it's, it's very it's different. I like it. Like how I perceive, um, like give me an example. I don't know, we're like, remember we took that little trip mm-hmm. to the mountains mm-hmm. and we're driving down mm-hmm. and you just see some trees and you're like, that tree bark, I love that. Oh yeah, the, like, the red tree bark. The, the tree? <laughs> I take you all the way out here into the and, mountains. And you're looking at tree and bark? And you're looking at the tree bark? I don't know. Love. That's, that's a good answer. Stands up there, and yeah. Cool. That's a good answer. Thank you. Thanks. Nice. I love that. Okay, here you, you can pick one from number three. three? Yeah. I'll just get into now. Final card. No, don't take the final card. Is that the last card? Oh, is it? Yeah, I think that's like the last last card. Wild card. Both players share something you're most grateful for in this current moment. <laughs> if it ain't me, <laughs> I'm, gonna I'm leaving. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I like in this moment something very specific that I'm grateful sure. for is the fact that I can let you into like any part of my life and you just fit in. Are you telling me I fit in here? Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Like you're just like you're nervous but like you're willing to do it and because yeah. that's something that i want to do and you like why support not? me because yeah. why not and you're like open to it and i think yeah. that's like i'm really grateful that you are because yeah. like if you were like no i don't want to do that like that's putting me like too that's far stupid. out there that's stupid that's yeah dumb. i wouldn't do that i wouldn't want to do that that's dumb <laughs> <laughs> that's dumb and that's stupid dumb stupid, stupid. idiot <laughs> I just really just put my nose all the way up. I'm just grateful to be here, to be to be with you, because you know the whole long distance thing. Yeah, I haven't seen you in but, 52 days. Yeah, but but like like you said, I'm grateful that we can do things like this. You know? Yeah, we're we're open to trying new things. Yep. Nice. Nice. Cool. Love. I like Next question is gonna be like, which one you had to die first? <laughs> Who's it gonna be? <laughs> Who's it gonna be? When in this game did you feel most connected to me? Well, we kind of just started. But... Um, when during this game? Yeah. I I feel like I'm always connected to you. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. It's if I like that need episode in SpongeBob where when you lift the shirts and you can see there's like a fleshy tube of skin connected to the other person. Do we- Yes. yes. I also always feel connected to you. Thank You're you. not alone that, in that, that's I what promise. I, was for. I just can't hold back. I'm such a SpongeBob kid. Yeah. yeah. We know. We know. If we were in a band, what would our name be? <laughs> I kind of like the macro. Then we can do the the, the logo. Yeah. The M. Oh yeah. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna draw it out for you guys because the first love letter this guy wrote to me. We were shopping on Queen Street. Mhm. And we went to the Mech. And um, they had all these like post-it notes so you could just write your own message or whatever. And this guy goes in and does like a little version of the Kraft Dinner logo. And if you know me, you know I'm a sucker for craft dinner. Straight out of the box, no topping. That's the thing, no topping. Yeah. It's not meant to be topped. 
And he just drew this, so this was this would be our band logo. What genre? House. 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 Yeah, I can see it. House. The house. Do we dance on stage? No, I think we just both have turntables. <laughs> we dance and we dance like the you, Yeah, you, yeah. <laughs> Macaronis. I don't know. Yeah, absolutely. I love that. Okay, let's... Be sponsored by Craft We could be sponsored by Craft Beer. Get yeah, free box. Craft That's all we need. That's really all we need. Just... Maybe we should pivot the show. When this game is over, what will you remember about me? That I... What will I remember about you? Well, considering I'm never going to see you again. Yeah, this is, um, this is it. I will probably remember that you are very brave and that things that are hard, you will still do. Because yeah. you want to support me. Because why not? Because why not? Why heck and not? Why the heck not? Each player write a message to each other, fold and exchange, open only once you two have parted. What if I don't want to part? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess that's it. Um, we're not going to do that one. Cause, uh, well, well, I guess we do that. That's one thing about long distance. Is that oh, yeah, we do that. When, when we leave, we, we write each other little notes. Plain notes. Plain notes or car notes. It's so depressing. It is a little bit sad. Right? Like, it gets to the point where you're just on the plane and you're just like, gosh, darn it. Can we turn this thing around? Can we just make up a lie about how someone's giving birth and we've got to... But we do it. But we do it. And uh, it'll be worth it. It's, it's worth it because in the end, we'll be together forever. Forever. It's, it's, it's not that I have anything against Bowie. It's just that... I think dogs, it's a big commitment, you know? I've big committed commit. to her. Yeah. And she's committed to me. But let's say we want to go out for a nice fancy dinner, right? Like We're bringing the we, dog. <laughs> we, we get dressed up, right? She gets dressed up. <laughs> we we get a res at L Furniture. Impossible at this time, but yeah. Yeah, it's tough. You, you got to know some people. And we're like, oh, fuck. like, we have this nice dinner. Yeah. There's a show going on. Mm -hmm. We don't go to see shows, but no. this is very hypothetical. This is things we have to think about. This, if yeah, we right? And an we're like, we want to go see a show. Yeah. We can't. We got to go back home, take yeah. the dog for a walk so yeah. I can go piss. <laughs> right? <laughs> the moral of today's show is don't have pets. Don't have, don't bring pets into your relationship. Don't bring pets because it'll just tear everything apart. If you apart. can, try not to do long distance, but if you need to, it works. It works, and um, and this game was this fun. game was pretty it was, fun. It was, it was cool. I, I, probably... I learned a lot about you. Really? Yeah. I learned a lot about you. All right, guys, thank you so much for tuning in once again to the Super Sensitive Show. This was Matt Cheval. You will be seeing him again probably at some point. Um, I hope so. I hope. <laughs> it was it was a lot of fun. I Th hope I see you at thanks some for point inviting me. within the next 52 calendar months. Um. Yeah, thanks for being here. I love you. Th thanks for having me. I love you, too. Bye, everybody. Ciao. PDA on the cam. Oh, on the couch. PDA on the cam. Is that all right?